The final thing in, in this chapter is simply the definition of something called a, a zero-sum game. In some of the examples uh, we've seen above, um, it's not necessarily that one of the players wins when the other player loses. For example, in the prison's dilemma, if both players cooperate, they both get a better utility. A zero-sum game is simply a, a game when we have that A is equal to minus B. And that's uh, the simple notion that uh, when the gains to one player uh, correspond to the losses of another. So, for example, um, this game um, is zero sum. Right? Because uh, this matrix A and this matrix B are um, equal to the opposite of each other, but uh, simply um, changing that to be 1, minus 2, minus 1, 1, and minus 1, 1, 1, minus 1. Well, that's not equal to, to 0, so it's not the zero-sum game.